Nicholas, welcome to the next part. Okay, so I'm trying to do it in small chunks so that you have can access it little by little rather than watching a long, long video. Right, so now what we're going to work on is getting some other extra bits on there. So we need to do the Irish classification as well. So let's get that on there. So we go to just go to Google Irish classification we can copy that image in. And then we just edit paste. It comes up, move it. Step backwards. So yeah, move it, use the tool. Move it into place, control T, copies the size. And again, it's in place, but we now need to get rid of the white background although they seem to this i think they might have cut off again the the background for for this one but anyway you guys are going to need to do it make sure it's perfect when you do it uh just going to make sure that's the right size slightly smaller isn't it mm, that's slightly too big And I'm just going to put that next to it like that. It's not quite perfect. There's something wrong with that, but that's fine. I'm going to leave it there because you guys can make sure it's perfect. And I'm going to go and get the DVD video one that goes on there. Copy image. Edit paste. Ooh. Every now and again, when you get an image, it does come up the wrong it just comes up black for some strange reason. I'm not entirely sure what that is, but let's see if this one works. Yep, it always works the second time when I do it on these videos. Uh, and now let's just move. Uh, what have I done there? Let me just, this is probably why I like to use and do it in the other, in the other panel. Okay, let me just do it in my, the way that I normally do it quickly so go, I go to file new create edit paste uh, and then I like to I'll get rid of the background there we'll press delete well copy I'm going to copy it now edit copy go back to here edit paste I'm going to move it along here use the pixel the tool to Get rid of the background. Press Control T to make it smaller. I think all of these logos are slightly too big, to be honest, but something that we can sort out later so we've got that there um, and we're gonna just go now and take the logo gonna do control C because you're gonna put it on the spine and then we're gonna go to Control V, so we've copied it. Control T, and we need to transform it and move it so it goes on the spine, so it moves onto the side. So we rotate it. We need to make that smaller as well so that it fits along the spine, but we need it to be the same, obviously, consistent font. Let me see how this looks. Apply slightly too big. Control T. This is where I'm going to zoom in actually now because I want to make it perfect, but I'm not having enough space. So I think that's going to be fine. Let me 
apply that and zoom out. Good, that's very good. I like that. Maybe move that along a little bit. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to copy up the um, certification. Where is that certification? Well, the DVD one as well needs to be on there. I don't actually know what I've done. Hmm. So let me take this one, control C, control V. Just move that to the bottom. Control T to make it smaller. Apply. And now I need is this the DVD? Yeah, the DVD one. Control C. Control V. Ah, uh, step back. See, this is the thing. Sometimes it can be very fiddly. Now, what have I done with it? There is got. That's why you got to make sure it's on the layer specifically. Make that control T, make that smaller. I'm just going to see what happens if I invert that. It looks like, yeah, I think that looks better. So it's clear. Now I want to move the 18 down. So it goes down there. And I need the certification. This is why it's good sometimes to label the uh, the layers so you know. T. I made that too small to be honest, but we're going to be here all day and you guys are going to do it perfectly. So fantastic. So I've done that now. Um, the last thing I want is the studio, isn't it? I want the studio on there. Um, I'm trying to think really. So studio canal. OK, we're going to go for. That's the studio. Going to press copy image, edit paste. I'm going to get rid of the background by using the pixelate tool. Delete. And I'm going to go to Control T, make it smaller. I'm just going to try that over here with a Studio Canal works over there. Press enter. Mm, I think that kind of. Maybe press enter. Mm, I'm not sure if Studio Canals on the DVD, if that's a convention for it going there. Probably goes here, to be honest. So I think that's probably better but I want to be in in line with everything else mm, it doesn't look quite correct it doesn't quite look correct but for now I think I'm just going to leave it there it doesn't quite look correct I don't think but control C and control V again it definitely on the spine it will look good Control T and F 
flip it. Flip it around. Now, I've just noticed something there that the screen is the wrong way around as well. When it reads, it needs to be the same way as the Studio Canal is actually. So let me just find where the layer is for Scream. Well, I think I'll change that. I might have to change that in a minute. So it's the right layer. But I can't find it at the moment. Oh, there it is. So control T. And just needs to go around that way. And that's better. Right, so fantastic. That's looking really good now. One thing also I'll say is that it's the scariest film of the decade. Um, and five star, but he hasn't said who it's five star from. So let's just say Empire Magazine. So it's a renowned, oops, it's a renowned magazine. And Let's invert that. Well, wait a sec. Everything's going wrong for me now, <laughs> all of a sudden. Uh, image adjustment. No, that's not there. So let me just do Control T, make that really, really, really small because it, it's not an important part of the thing I think I still think that's too big mm, yeah I think that looks better but still maybe a little bit too big to be honest the Empire that's much better all right so that is all done there the spine the front and the uh, the logos all finished uh, that's the end of that bit and now we're going to go to the back for the last part of the video see you in a bit